all right ladies and gentlemen what is going on gi geo gamer here and today i'm going to be bringing you a different style of video in this video i'm trying out a new game path of exiles it's been out i've never played it um and this is just going to be a little bit of a trial video i don't have my webcam turned on i want this to be i want you guys to you know see the game for what it truly is um now in uh in this um, because I still don't have my new video card, it does cause a good bit of lag in my recording sometimes. I'm not recording at a solid 30 FPS, um, which you may see at some points. My apologies, um, there really is nothing I can do until I buy something new, uh, for my video card. So, for now, let's jump into the game, let's check it out. Path of Exile. Can I limit the FPS? I don't believe so. Um, let's go ahead and jump into this. So, I picked up this weapon. Default attack. Strike your foes down with a powerful blow. Let's go talk to the dying exile. Once I catch my breath here, what's up? What? It's just a casual corpse Even that just killed him. Challenge me here. What? Double strike. To socket the skill gem, first click it, then click on the same socket with your weapon. The skill is now equipped on your skill bar. Performs two fast attacks with your... Alright. Interesting. Uh, how do I close that? There we go. So, now we just explore around, I assume. This guy drowned. So the bottom left is our red health. Bottom right, I'm assuming, yep, is our mana. You can hold shift to attack without moving. Okay. Ouch. Alright, so... What is the... Press, press 1 to heal. Okay. And those have charges. Alright, interesting. Um... So for those of you curious, this game, as you can see in chat, is a little bit like Diablo 3, if you're curious. Uh, we have a chest with nothing in it. So these guys are essentially all undead, apparently. Oh, okay. Right-clicking does that. Oh, cool. Oh yeah, that's, that's really efficient. So, oh, a curved bow. Alright, that could be useful. Let's run away, go back at him. Nice. Alright, so, uh, so far, um, yep, we could do that. Not really interested in it. Um, I, I don't know, I don't really play this style of game too much, but honestly, it looks pretty good. Um, like it looks like a pretty decent game if you're interested in this style. Just exploring around a corpse, we can loot a plate vest. Nice, we got a bit of armor. Can we swim? Apparently, we just walk in the water for now. Uh, a driftwood club. So this must be a new weapon. A one-handed mace. Physical damage five to seven. This is 4 to 8. 5% critical hit, 5% critical hit, 1.45, 1.45, stun duration, increased accuracy rating. Uh, I think I'll keep the sword for now, unless I can put that in this hand. What does that do? So now they alternate? Alright, interesting. We have that 14 uh, armor.
Easy. Sand spitters, okay. Did we regen health? No, we don't. That's a bit unfortunate. So again, we're just exploring along the beach. You can hold down mouse click for attacks as well. Alright, which is nice. Alright. Let's just do a bit more exploring. Maybe find something to do. Bust down these barrels. Keep looking around a little bit. Oh, shoot. Enemy at the gate. Hillock. This looks like a trap. It's definitely a trap. Is that like this guy's home? Look at that guy. He's got arrows in him. Well, let's go. Nice, the double attack. That's what we need. My spirit is spent. Oh no, drink up, drink up. Heal, heal. Alright, so this club is actually doing good damage. We did heal up. It's nice not to be dead yet. Definitely it's nice to not be dead. Let's pick up all of his stuff. You gained a skill point. Click here to use your skill point. Alright, so... Uh, where do you start? Strength, dexterity and intelligence. So this is mana. So there's no upgrades for that right now it looks like. I'm not sure. 14 increased physical damage with attacks plus 14 to max life or attack speed and accuracy. I'm gonna go ahead and get this one. One unconfirmed. Apply points. Okay. So now we do more damage. 7 to 17 physical damage, 9 to 16. That's a lot more. Uh, and then we have to enter the town for your reward. Enter the gate. Okay. I'm assuming that's up here. Um, where is the town? This looks like a gate. Oh, Lion Eyes Watch. Okay. So we have a little person here who's just watching apparently. Um, and let's just go ahead. What is this? Letters of Exile. Creighton of Theopolis. Missive of Sentence, Court of Divine Temperance, Theopolis, 1598 IC. You have transgressed against your god and your fellow men. You have a willing vessel for unvalid, blah, 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 blah. Two counts of grand larceny, seven counts of grand larceny, nine counts of extortion, four counts of armed robbery. Being unwilling to obtain an occupant, blah, blah, blah. Can I scroll through this faster? Alright, I think that's all useless. Talk to Tarkley. Alright, this is another player. Um, Alright. So, Tarkley, where are you at, my dude? Uh, I'm assuming you'll have an exclamation point. Oh, there you are, yep. My work with Hillock. Where'd you learn to fight like that? No, don't tell me. We exiles have no history. Dominus took it from us the moment his blackguards dumped us in the water out there. Just live or die now. Here, have one of these. And no need to thank me. I'm thinking of myself and the others here. The longer we fighters live, the longer everyone lives. New weapon? Um, select one reward. So, oh, these are skill gems which we put in our um, attack, of course. Bow, not interested. Melee, melee. Alright. So, cleave. The character swings their weapon or both weapons if dual wielding and arc towards the target also damages nearby monsters. Only works with axes and swords when deal waiting deal 60% damage from each weapon combined. Alright, and this attacks the target with a physical and fire damage causing balls of molten magma to launch forth from the weapon as you swing. These will explode causing AoE attack damage to enemies where they land. Two additional projectiles, 60%. Okay, um, 6 mana, 6 mana. I think I like this one. 
Um, yes, I believe I like this one. Now, what do we want to upgrade? Can we take... We can take... Oh, we can't take them out. Ooh, okay. We have a two-handed mace. But again, the damage of it is just not really what I'm interested in. Uh, so what do we do now? Continue to explode? Um, did I just say explode? Continue to explore? We're going to the coast. You've entered the coast. Give me one second. Not the most pleasant of arenas, but it'll have to do for now. Wait, we're in an arena? I actually really like the poise. Like, I think the voiceover is really clear. You know, not bad. Wait, is this like a... Oh, snap. So we can now... Is that middle click? Yeah, it is. Oh, stink. Get out of there. So let's just middle click all these guys then. Look how easy that is. Okay. And our mana actually regens pretty quickly. Honestly, like I said... Like I did say earlier, I'm not really into these style of games, but I'm actually kind of digging this. I'm not gonna lie, your skill gen can be leveled up. Alright, so we just upgraded it apparently. Uh, we are low on HP. I don't know how we can heal that. I don't want to keep using our flasks. Um, I'm not sure. I'm not sure. Um, like, I don't know, because I don't want to use them up. Currently, it's 21 charges. Refills as you kill... Oh, it refills as you kill monsters. Consume 7 of 21 charges on use. Alright. Um, so... Oh, we got some infested crabs. And a king crab. Uh, so what is this going to upgrade? I don't know. Kind of occupied. Oh, stink. Alright, well let's just upgrade it. Maybe... Oh wait, am I supposed to be picking those individually? I don't know. Ouch. So yeah, these are all recharging as we go. Uh, let's check this dude out. Basically just some new weapons. Come at me. Oh. Oh, get stunned. Uh, uh, let's just pick all these up. We can Wait, a ton of hatchets. Just, oh, these are axes now. Okay, yep. Um, they have the same range. So I don't think they're of any use to us. Maybe we can sell them later on. Not really sure about that. Oh, wait, you didn't die? Gravel Eater. Interesting. Stupid larva diarrhea on the ground. That sounds interesting as well. Another impaled corpse. Ooh, a hat. Nice. We got some more armor. So basically, we just kill a lot of things, get a lot of health regen for free. Nice. Uh, so you do, I don't think I clarified this, you move around with click. See, so look at all this stuff. Wait, is this what happens if you die? Do you, like, find other people's stuff? Um, iron hat, armor 8, armor 8. Evasion rating 21, armor 14. I think we do want to go ahead and keep the armor. Um... Oh, nice. I like how the inventory manages, actually. We do have these bucklers. Uh, I don't think we really need them right now. Uh, but let's just continue exploring for a little bit longer. 
I may indeed decide to continue this series a little bit longer uh, if I enjoy it, which I am, you know, I seem to be so far. Alright, this is going to get a little bit dicey. Probably should not have just stood in that fire. Couldn't have been too wise. I think this club sword is a pretty good combo right now, though. Uh, I think we need to continue pushing up. Alright, nothing in there. Alright, let's just continue pushing out around here. Why not? Alright. Alright, things are gonna get a little bit dicey. I need to get out of that- Oh! Oh god, I need to get out of that fire. No! Oh. It seems this new arena suits me. New arena. Oh! Fire Fury. Oh wait, this is somebody new. I believe in traveling light. That was kind of disgusting. So we actually can't pick up this stuff anymore. So let's um let's drop the jerkin. Let's drop the hat. Um we'll drop a buckler. We have some gauntlets, which we can put on our hands. A gnarled branch, which is just another weapon. A padded vest. This could have better armor. No, it does not. Alright, what's this stick? It's a staff. It's two-handed. Don't think we're really interested in that right now. Alright. So, I don't know, I guess we're geared up pretty decent. I'm not really too sure. Probably should go ahead and heal up. I really like having, like, I think these, these weapon combos is actually pretty good. Plate vest, why did I pick that up? 14, 14, yeah. So, I don't need most of this stuff. Wait, to identify it. Oh, you figure, wait. I don't know what the point of identifying it is. It's purple. Which makes me think it's a decent weapon, but I'm not sure if I want to keep it. So can I not use it until I identify it? Let's try it. Right click this item, then left click. Okay, so it just gives us like some more stats on it. Now if I take this off, and then take this off. Uh, oh jeez, that needs to go down there. Then I can equip that and fight with this. So what is this stat? 11 range, 8 to 17 damage. Let's try fighting with a staff for a little bit. Let's try fighting with a staff for a little bit. Um, play best. Don't need, don't need. Spawn fire gonna catch you. Oh, snap. Alright, here we go. Now I do, of course, not have any extra wet... Um, Alright, hold up. Go away, go away. I'm trying to do something. Alright, um, can I take my gems out of this? Oh, I can. But you use a different type. Oh, okay. That's weird. Uh, I'm not sure. Um, like how we get another weapon for this. I think I kind of like it though, but I, I'm not sure how I feel about losing my other, um, gems. Because I did kind of like having those other abilities. Um, you know, the fire attack, the, um, the molten magma, and the, the double strike. Calm's canoe struck this sand with the force of destiny. At his back, the greatest war host in Kardui history tamed the wild sea, their canoes coupling with the land one by one. Lion-eyes gemlings met us with shining metal and bold words. 
Hyrie's arrows withered their pride. Calm's axes silenced their despair. Marseille's lion eye fought bravely to the last. Calm honored him with a place on his belt. Calm has shown Rayclast our Karui strength. Calm will teach Rayclast the Karui way. The Karui way. Interesting. Uh, a waypoint. Um, so this actually shows us the map. The coast. These are new quests or new areas, I assume. Alright, I guess uh, this is as good a place as any to go ahead and end off this episode. We just hit 20 minutes. I hope you guys did go on to enjoy this. Um, I know I certainly did. Um, and probably we'll record a few more videos on it in the future. But guys, if you did enjoy this video, uh, leave it a like, subscribe. I do a variety of games. And uh, as always, if you did enjoy, I will definitely see you in the next one.